I just saw this video with Dr. David Angus on CBS this morning. They're talking about the Zika virus. And out of nowhere, he mentions the flat earth. What is this all about? Of course, he's just one of many puppets that you see on TV. They're all puppets. And this is part of getting into the mind. And again, I talk about the flat earth and how they will reveal it one day. And this is part of subconscious programming. It's getting it out there in every which way possible, even as subtle as just supposedly mistakenly saying it, and it's no mistake. You watch TV news over the years, not until recently have you heard some, some mistake like this happen. So why does this happen? It's not, again, a mistake. It's all part of, again, getting into the subconscious, pushing the flat earth subconsciously. It's like I stated one day, the truth of the flat earth will be revealed. Mosquitoes, these kind of mosquitoes are here in the United States. And we now know that these mosquitoes can get Zika virus very easily from biting somebody. And the world is flat, right? The World Cup happened. And then all of a sudden, people from Brazil went all over the, the world. Buddy, and the world is flat, right? And the world is flat, right? Zika contamination. It's a public health nightmare. Mm. And so I think when we all look at this, we, we have to learn from it. Zika will be the first of many viruses over the years because the world is flat. Because the world is flat. Because the world is flat. It's understood that Hollywood sells Californication. Space may be the final frontier, but it's made in a Hollywood basement. In Cobain, can you hear the spheres singing songs off station to station? And now 